When teachers observe other teachers, can they interpret it? Can they evaluate what they see is another question. There are nine approaches to help teachers observe one another. This idea is inspired by a term you may have heard, at least in the medical profession, doctor rounds. Teacher rounds, lesson study, and good observation models we all know can make a difference to the teacher. The challenge for us all is how to protect this time fiercely for teachers to learn from one another. Tip number one is to identify the group of teachers taking part in the study. Now think about how many teachers you've got across your school or a particular group of teachers who want to participate. You need to have your teachers in groups of three or four. You have a small enough group for it to be successful without watering down the challenges to bring teachers together to observe one another. Tip number two, with lots of safeguarding disclaimers, teachers need to film one another. Ensure that the technology is available in the school to do this. Also ensure there's a clear focus agreed before the recording takes place and you also have student consent. Tip number three, each teacher takes some time to reflect on their own observation and try to evaluate how they performed alongside the agreed focus Tip number four, each teacher comes together to present their reflections and their focus. Tip number five, each teacher is assigned a specific role. Tip number six, they then agree what feedback has to be shared. Remember tip five, agreed role, one person that's feeding back. Tip number seven, the feedback needs to be focused, concise and direct so that the teacher can take some action. It's important that this is maybe using a script that the conversation flows in the busy nature of school life. Tip number eight, the teacher then identifies what actions they're going to take, what support they might need and by when. Tip number nine, each of the teachers swap roles and take a turn to observe and feed back to one another. Take a look at the research on lesson study, also Dr. Kenny Frederick's doctoral research on teacher rounds. We all know observations make a big difference. The challenge is for all our skills is to protect the time, to give teachers the tools, and to ensure the methodology is sustained and successful.